Let's start where I left off in part with uh, Senator Vance. We were talking about the situation in Springfield, Ohio. He has blamed the Biden-Harris administration and its policies for the fact that there has been an influx of Haitian migrants. It's the result of a, a policy called temporary protective status, which allowed hundreds of thousands of Haitian migrants who have been fleeing poverty and violence to potentially uh, seek shelter here. The Springfield, Ohio mayor told NBC that immigrants have put a strain on resources. How do you respond to those officials in Springfield and other cities who are, quite frankly, concerned about a strain on resources? Yeah, a community like Springfield, Ohio, is dealing with rapid uh, economic growth and rapid population growth, some of it connected to immigration. And uh, the mayor there, just as as I was dealing with challenges when I was mayor in South Bend, Indiana, uh, is focused on how to bring a community together, move it forward, and help it grow. What is not going to help that mayor, what is not going to help that community, is the kind of chaos inflicted on them by a national campaign deciding to make them a lightning rod over wild rumors and urban legends about people eating cats or or dogs or or geese or whatever it's going to be tomorrow. And let's be very clear, uh, that community and the very real people who are dealing with uh, some really ugly stuff right now, like the bomb threats, uh, are having that inflicted on them as part of the strategy from a campaign that wants to talk about anything but their actual record and their actual agenda. Uh, Donald Trump and J.D. Vance cannot afford for this campaign to be about things like uh, how Donald Trump eliminated the right to choose and uh, continues to leave the door open to signing a national abortion ban. They definitely don't want this uh, campaign to be about things like how we had a manufacturing recession under Donald Trump and what we have to do to keep the manufacturing boom that is going on right now uh, going. These are not things they want to be talking about. Uh, obviously, they don't want to be talking about the particulars uh, of the Trump fans' health care plan because they don't have one. They, they have this so-called concept of a plan uh, that, that he keeps saying is around the corner. He's been saying that, I think, for nine years. So they need to get us talking about something else. The crazier, the better. Uh, and they go for something that is so outrageous that uh, you actually can't ignore it. Uh, uh, the media can't uh, ignore what's going on because very real pain has been inflicted uh, on uh, and fear, by the way, uh, on people in this community and other communities around the country. Yeah. Uh, and yet, if we take the bait and are completely diverted uh, by it, then we're not talking about what this campaign is supposed to be about, which is the future of the American people. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.